Hello gang, welcome back to Minecraft Monday, something I've been working on for a while, finally came to fruition. I'm starting here by the river fort, which was just a tower and has been expanding as the village next to it has been expanding as well. Because I want to be able to see something, if you can spot it up there, that crosshairs around on top of it. Yes, that's one of my military service towers. Up on top of that mountain peak as it goes up. What's well, on top? It's on a bluff part way up. As I said, it's because something I've been working on has come to fruition. So I'm going to take the road out, go around the, cause I go around, go around the other side, but I'm going to clip ahead, so I'll just meet you out there. All right, gang, here, so I've really got to update the signpost. Deep water is that way. Founding seat and capital is back behind us. And north is, of course, everything north. You can just see the correlations of one of, of one of the forts right there. One with no settlement. Watches the river where the desert turns into the deep forest. As north to Lamatan and all those fun places. We want to take the deep water route. Headphones sounding off. Uh, it's sounding good again. All right. As you will see, there's a break in the road. A new fork. There's deep water just in the distance. I can hear zombies underneath somewhere. <clears throat> I've been working on off and on with other things, but didn't want to show until it was ready in its entirety. Maybe I'll see a staircase in the distance. It's the Sun Temple. Temple to the Sun. Nice little pathway leading off. Ooh, let's fix that. <laughs> Down and through. Up into the mountains. A little winding path come up and through. A monastic temple in the clouds. I just up a few stairs. No, it's it's like a Skyrim ascending the mountain steps type thing. Maybe not that many. Into the clouds. The sheep are always getting in my way and being a bother, so I fenced them. Hold up. What are you still doing alive up here? Die. I'm thinking eventually I might found a village. On this landing. It's a nice place up in the clouds. <laughs> up and through. Stay on the path. You don't want to. Um... <clears throat> yeah. It's going to lava down there. Just in case the fall doesn't get you. Yeah. Some. Um... Well, the tree at least makes it look a little more pleasant right here. Uh, going around the outside is going to be a pain, so I just carved my way up the inside. Now, as far as the f tower, the outpost I showed you, it's right here. Oh, I never did come back and put any kind of railing on this. Kitty cat or Pixie are going to come out that door and just plumb it up to their doom. I gotta fix that. Yeah, so. One of the main points I noticed when I was working my way up top was that from here, not only can this fort be seen by and see the river fort sitting down there protecting the village, but off the other side, it can see the lonely farm and the fort over the great underground crevasse and such that's down there. Made a bunch of videos exploring that area. You can get mining out huge sections of it, Gorbin style. Can I see you over there, Mr. Creeper? <laughs> oh, he didn't drop. Oh, good enough. He's dead. I am not going to worry about getting those. No. That was just a kill for the pleasure of mop-up. 
up to guards if need be can be posted down here go back up the stairs to try and go around it's all dead ends literally very dead ends okay yeah okay there's no falling through ah oh, we're way around and up and through the cliffs on the side and i've got it prepped so i can work my way up to that other side eventually but for now piggy pig you get in my way i will just kill you some nice habitation for the monks Sunflowers go beautifully with white wool to make some nice gold for the beds of the monks of the Sun Temple. You know what? The sun is setting. I may I may show you the temple and then I'll come back to actually sleep the night off so we can see the sunrise in the morning. Actually, if I do that, we won't really catch the sunrise. Anyway... You're looking up, you might be, wait a minute. I did, in fact, come through. I replaced about half the construction I already had done with end bricks. I've been mining from the end dragon and enderman realm. That combined with sandstone. Lots of nice carpet. Where people can come and observe the rising of the sun over the edge of the world. See the road down below. See so much of the countryside from up here. This was crazy. I'm actually amazed I didn't fall off and kill myself doing this. <laughs> oh, almost did several times. This is actually relatively safe. You don't bounce or run too far. You get over that edge down there and you are gone. All right, I'm going to fast forward to sunrise. can actually see it rising gang before see the sun rising before the moon is set that's cool I was expecting it to be a little bit longer getting up <laughs> I wonder if we can still see the moon off the other side yeah. I purposely did not bring up glass, did not put in windows. It's a sun temple, temple to the sun. It's open to the rays, the warmth, and the cross breeze. Now, the last thought that I found while doing all this... Hmm. Take you down. Ah. Dang it, I can see the armor over there. I'm going to have to try and get that. Darn it. I don't have a lot of... Wait. All right, I've got a good amount of stone block. All right, there's something else I found that I want to take you to, but darn it. I can see the armor that survived my attack. I've got to try. Watch, now I'm going to follow my doom. That's going to be embarrassing. Hmm. I just dig my way up. Let's shoot. Crap. 
push that guy out. There he is. Very, very quiet. I'm hunting Skelly. Got him. All right, that makes us a little less heart attackish. Oh, I got this. Oh, of course. Don't check my back. Make sure there's no creepers. I had a bunch of sniping through the night, killing things over here. So, since I'm up here anyway, I may as well get. Is the potato really worth it? Not really, but we'll do it anyway. All right. Let's gather. Experience. The loot. The salvage. Ooh, darn it. It's all gone. I sniped like four witches over here. Uh, all their experience pellets and anything they may have dropped is gone. This really makes my body tense, and it shouldn't. I hate heights. Which is hilarious now. I mean, I fall. Character's dead. I'm not hurt. Ah, I lose 42 levels of speed. Wah. I mean, shoot. Back when I was in the army, I did air assault and... All manner of craziness. Shoot, not in the army I did smoke jumping and crap. Okay. Let's get back to the path. But you know what? Jumping out of stuff with a parachute never bothered me. Let's go get to the adventure that I purposely saved so we can do it together. Let's take a minute. <laughs> do, 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 do. Down the stairs, down the stairs. I need to put in like a corral down at the bottom so I can ride horses out and leave them down at the bottom of the mountain. And that beautiful flooring of water we're about to come out and be facing is the source of what I found. Oh, checking things. Okay, it's just a gold chest plate. That's fine. Or at least this led me to it. Alright, going underground. Anybody in my way? You see it. I see it. Cobblestone and mossy cobblestone. Yeah, no coming up behind me. I got a dungeon delve. Let's clear this if possible. Ooh. Just jump to the rabbit. Spider up there somewhere wants to get at me. All right. That leads out normally. Nice. I won't have to go up the waterfall again. A vein of iron leading me around in crazy directions. All right. All good. And let's leave a torch back there. Just so we don't get spawns. Alright. Oh yeah, I hear you guys. Let's 
let's get some. Hi. Alright, I'm going to reseal that and I should put torches right here. Pick up the one I originally put down. Oh good, we spawned another. I want to make an alternate way in. I don't want to just open it up to the light. Um, I'm over here. Spam some torches. I'm going to take all those out because, I mean, sorry, this is right here off one of my roads. It's right here near the surface. It's just a zombie spawner, but still. I'm going to pull all those torches out. Let's see what kind of place I can make of it. All right, well, let's check the chest, because I'm going to get all the mossy cobblestone out of here. I'm going to pull some of the other cobblestone. Check the outer walls. See if... Nope. Nope. Not leading off to anywhere else. That's cool. I'm going to strip this out. I'm going to leave this intact, though, so that it can continue to spawn zombies whenever I want them. So, with that... I hear one somewhere, though. Anyway, let me your thoughts, comments, observations, suggestions down below. Hit the like or dislike. Subscribe if you haven't already. If you have, hit the little reminder bell or YouTube doesn't tell you when I put out fresh stuff. But more importantly than anything, remember, if there's something out there important to you, something that matters, whether it's up and out, face to face with others, or from the safety of behind your keyboard, get involved. Make a difference. But take care and keep yourself safe. I am the Articulate Grunt. And I hope to catch you later, because for now, I'm out from here. Bye. One sec, we didn't look in the chest together. So you got zombie flesh, gunpowder, melon seeds. Got plenty of those already. Uh, four, C418 to cat. I've got a bunch of those, but I'll take another. Name tag. King cat loves those. More zombie flesh. Ooh, gold horse armor. I will take that. Saddle. Book, book. Projectile protection 2. Alright. Melon seeds. You can all go there together. Alright. I'm going to have to eat the bread to make space. Especially since I want the cobblestone. I might have to throw some stuff away. Oh, chicken. All right, we've seen what's in them. I'm going to pull up the monster cobblestone, pull the trunks and everything. I'm going to need, like, three extra spaces. So. Now, I'm out from here. Bye.